Thing. At one time or another, you've probably looked at a digital watch, a calculator, or a laptop computer screen. Well, did you know that the practical application of those liquid crystal displays, LCDs, originated right here in Mercer County? Last night at the David Sarnoff Research Center, a presentation of that history. Shortly after the researchers in Princeton invented color television in 1950, RCA's David Sarnoff asked scientists to make a flat panel TV that could hang on the wall. Well, it took some 30 years before that happened, but the groundbreaking work that led to numerous applications along the way began here at the RCA David Sarnoff Research Center in 1965. Last night, Hiro Kawamoto gave a lecture about his recently published article in the IEEE publication about the history of the development of liquid crystal displays. This was, again, is a historical thing. That was 1964. And what it means is there's a cell and a liquid crystal sandwich between the two plates. Liquid crystals were known in the 19th century, but the breakthrough work in the 1960s by local scientists Dr. George Heilmeyer, Luke Barton, and WZBN founder Lou Zanoni brought about the everyday uses of these unusual liquids. By applying electrical fields to the liquid crystal, it was possible to change its reflected light. This discovery led to the creation of popular products such as digital watches, calculators, notebook computers, and even instruments in the space shuttle cockpit. Okay, no, no. And now flat panel okay, TV no, no. displays can hang on the wall. Reporting in Princeton, Brian Bossler, WZBN News.